right? Go to store. Well, I'm going to show you that, but before we do all that, guys, I want to just, you know, like, before I even show the score, man, I want to give a, such a huge congratulations to Miss Bianca, man. Like, I just want to give her a huge congratulations, man. They hate when you elevate The second up losses, I'm handing them out, yeah, I had to go delegate They feel like I'm floating, I'm lost in the moment, I swear I could levitate They never believed that I would really fly, I had to go demonstrate I had to set them straight What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Damian Cryer And I am back with another freaking video If you guys have not subscribed to the Cryer family All you gotta do is turn that bell on to subscribe to the channel but being subscribed only means you are subscribed. Also guys, I drop daily videos every single day, seven days a week on the Damien Cryer YouTube channel. Go on over there and subscribe to that channel right now, man. We is going literally bonkers over on that channel. If you don't believe me, all you gotta do is type in Damien Cryer. Go on over there and check out the videos over there. Also guys, I'm proud to announce we just hit one point two million subscribers over on Facebook fam. Speaking of Facebook guys, I upload videos on Facebook seven days a week. Let me make sure I got 1.2 million because I seen that earlier in my settings, but I don't know if it actually updated. And if it did, I'm gonna go ahead and post a picture of it. Bam, there it is, 1.2 million guys. We hit 1.2 million on Facebook today. So again, I will be uploading a clip of this in this video, man. Thank you all who recently came over and follow me over on Facebook, man. And also on the Damien Cryer channel, a lot of people are coming over to the channel every day, man. Uh, I'm just grateful for the four, five, 600 people that subscribe to the Damien Cryer YouTube channel every day, man. It really means a lot to me. And this is the reason why I'm gonna continue pumping out this content for you guys. Speaking of content, guys, as you guys know, when you become a content creator, you have to always upgrade your equipment, whether it's your computers, your MacBooks, or whatever that you use for your editing software, your cameras, everything has to be quality. Quality over quantity. Once you get the quality down pack, then you can work on the quantity. So I'm gonna do this quick video for you guys and show you what I have going on because your boy have been called out by the Prince family today, man. The Prince family called me out today, man. And, you know, there were some things that were said over the phone when I got the call this morning about exposing me, right? But we're gonna get into all that later on. I will be putting that video clip in this right here. Um, you know, because I don't like when my kids call me out, what they gonna do to me, how they gonna do me and all this other stuff. But we're gonna get into all that later on in this video. So I was talking earlier about updating camera equipment. Now I bought this equipment about a week earlier. I'm just now getting around to doing a video to unboxing this stuff for you guys. So as you guys do know, I vlog with the G7X Canon. I actually have three, no, no, no. I have two GX7 Canons, which is this one that I'm using right now to vlog with. I have another one right here in the closet that I use to vlog with. I haven't used that camera in probably a while. It's not a G7X, it's a G740. Actually, I'm gonna show you guys. Okay guys, so this right here is the G740. See that right there? This is the G740. It's almost similar to the one that I'm vlogging with right now. It's a really good camera. This has been in the closet for a long time right here. So this is one camera and the one I'm using for this video is the G7X, which is the one that I'm vlogging with right now for this video. And now I have my third camera and this is my first time having a Sony. So I'm just gonna unbox it. Yes, I have already used it in a couple of videos. We're just like a trial run. I'm still working on trying to get the settings right. But this is my very, very first Sony guys. And I'm loving it so far. So. I end up buying the Sony camera. I have this tripod, it's a digital tripod, guys. Technology, it's my first time having a digital, uh, digital tripod. So this thing was not cheap whatsoever. But anyway, we're gonna get to that later on. We're gonna unbox the camera. Again, it's a Sony. 
in a couple directions and stuff like that. That's as it should. All the paperwork seems to be in place. Warranties. Okay, carefully take that out. This camera right here has actually came with the, I don't want to break this thing. Let's see, how do I do this? Oh, here we go. I'm going to show you this right here first. This is the Sony right here, guys. This is actually the newest one that's out right now. Get out the way, box. This is the newest Sony that's out right now. Where the other cameras actually flip up, this one actually, how you turn this camera on, like the other cameras, you push the button and it turns the camera on. This camera right here is way different. You have to open this up from the side and it actually turns the camera on. And then will I, bang, it turns it on guys. So this is the new Sony right here. Um, I cannot wait, to, I'm, I'm sorry. Then you, in order to turn the camera off, you just simply take the side angle of it and you just close it just like that. And that actually turns it off. It also comes with a noise reducer, guys. This actually came with the camera. As you guys see on the box, there's the noise reducer right there on it. So if you out in the wind vlogging and stuff, like you guys know, I go to the beach a lot to vlog. Well, I don't vlog every time I go to the beach. I go to the beach a lot, but I don't vlog. But when I do go to the beach and vlog, it's really windy in the background. So this is gonna help reduce some of that noise that you guys hear in the background. And it actually, uh, let's see here. How did I take this off? It goes this way. Uh, let's see, how did I take this thing off here? Oh, there we go. It just slides right on the camera. It slides on the camera just like that. Again, boom, open. And now I have to get used to looking at the camera because this camera would lead you to believe you have to look at this while you're vlogging, but you actually have to look at this. And the reason why I went with this camera right here, because even though that this is different than a G7X, the zoom on this camera is extremely sick. So if I use this camera right here, I would zoom in on something, it would blur up. This camera zooms in, it does not blur up whatsoever. Now the difference between this camera and my other cameras is it did not come with the battery charger, nor did Best Buy have the battery chargers for this since this camera is, is so new, which doesn't make sense to me that they don't have the camera, the battery chargers in stock. So I will sew this extra piece right here with it. It's a wall plug-in and you actually just flip this open on the side, plug it in without having to take the battery out and just plug it right in. So that's actually pretty cool. Um, plus you risk constantly opening up this bottom part right here constantly opening this up and taking a battery out and stuff like that, risk of breaking it. Uh, it came with one battery in a pack, but of course, you know me, I had to buy a couple extra batteries. Um, these batteries do go pretty quick because the quality that these cameras give off. These, these cameras right here are extremely high quality cameras. So that's the camera right there, guys. And this is the charger. I haven't opened this up yet. We're gonna go ahead and open it up. Again, it's a wall charger. Now, I do kind of like it a little bit, even though it's different than what I'm used to custom using, because my battery chargers for my other cameras, you can put three batteries in there at, at one time and they'll all charge together. So, they came with the cube and a block right there. So I can just plug it right in before I go to sleep at night, I can just plug it right in. And, or I got a place in my vehicle, I can plug the camera uh, charger in and plug the camera at the same time. So if I'm driving long distance, my camera will be charging while I'm driving. Now, for the good stuff right here, I'm really excited about this. I've never had a digital tripod. Now, a lot of you guys may wonder, what's the use of having a digital tripod versus a regular tripod? Well, there is a huge difference, in my opinion. You don't have to sit there and try to force it and bend it, you can just press the button. I'm not for sure how this thing works, I didn't have to buy this with the camera, but since I have a Sony camera, why not go ahead and get a Sony tripod? So I'm not for sure how this thing works. And if I can't figure it out, I would just call my son who would help me out to figure this out right here. I don't know if this has a battery in it or not. We're gonna find out, but this is what it looks like guys so far. It's got all the little buttons and stuff on it, the little gadgets, so you can like adjust the head and stuff like that, the angle of your camera. Um, oh, you also have a mode. Oh, you have it where it can take photos. Oh, everything, it has like the record mode and everything on it, guys. Again, I'm sure that this takes a battery or something. Oh, there it is right there. 
Okay, so that's the tripod. That's how it sits just like that. And I don't know if there's a battery in here or not, but we are going to find out what's, what's all this special stuff about. Is that a battery? Well, I guess, oh, this is the battery right here, guys. So I have to take this piece of paper off. Oh, there it is right there. Okay, take this off. And the battery's right there. I had to take the little paper off. And so now I know what type of battery to use. It uses the, type, the same type of battery that you would use for like your car charger remotes. So let's close it up and see what it does. Uh, it's not really doing anything right now. Lock, unlock. There's a light on it beeping right now. I hope you guys can see that when I press the button, the light beeps. So let's just put the camera on a tripod and just see what happens. I'm not for sure. Oh wow, this actually sits to the side too. So let's see what happens here. It's actually pretty cool. Hmm, is it not tightening? Oh wait, I see what it, okay, here we go. I'm doing all this twisting and turning. I don't have to even do all that. It's pretty cool. So I just got to figure out like what makes the, Okay, it says mode. I'm trying to get it to take the camera up. I'm not for sure how this works, guys. I'm gonna figure it out though off of camera. But I know, okay, so it would sit like that right there. You guys follow so far? And if I wanted to vlog a video, open it up, turn it on and it sits right on that tripod, just like that. Now, what I like about this is, again, guys, this is a this is a very extremely wide angle. Like on this camera that I'm vlogging with right now for this video, it's showing this part right here. But this camera right here, if I were to do a mukbang, I could turn this camera around towards me and it picks up everything. I got a lot of room on this side and a lot of room on that side without having to go out and buy one of those humongous Sony cameras that people use for like, when they doing like bigger videos and bigger vlogs and stuff. So this is actually perfect for that, man. So comment down below if you guys like this camera. Um, uh -uh, uh oh, I did something wrong. Again, as you guys see, I'm still struggling learning how to work this tripod because I do not know how to work it. And I don't want to damage anything. Let's see here. I can't get this to turn. I can't get this to do what I want it to do, but again, I'm at the, oh, wait, there it is. I think I got it. There we go. There we go. I want to see if I can get anything to, if I press the button, will it record? Uh, mode. Anyway, guys, I'm gonna have to figure this. Oh, I got blurred up. I'm sorry, guys, I got dark. Anyway, I'm gonna figure this out off camera, guys. But anyway, this is my new Sony camera with the digital tripod that actually goes with it. Um, I'm very excited to start using this camera. I'm thinking maybe. Oh, wait a minute, let's see something. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God, I wish you guys can see what I see. But I'm gonna start vlogging with this camera right here, guys, for now on, from this point on. But anyway, I'm, I'm not gonna make this part of the video very long because I have been called out by the Prince family and apparently there's some exposing going on today or allegedly my son is going to expose me. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I don't know what's gonna happen when I get here, when I pull up, what's going on. All I know is that I'm supposed to be getting exposed today. So whatever happens, man, wish me luck. I know whatever happened, I'm gonna come out on top. You know why? because I'm dang, I'm big dang. So anyway, guys, don't forget to smash that like button if you enjoyed this video on your way out the door. Don't forget to leave a comment. So without further ado, let's get into this video and let me go see what they talking about. So let's go. Yo, what's up guys, man, listen. I'm not feeling too good today, man. I'm not feeling good at all. And I'm gonna tell you why I'm not feeling good. I got a phone call sometime early this afternoon, you know, about exposing me. And you know, 
it's been a lot of exposure going on, man. There's been a lot of exposure going on, and I've just been trying to stay away from this exposure stuff. But the last person I expected in the world to come for me, to come for me, let me know that they can expose me, is my own son. I think his wife was in the background talking stuff too. So you know what, I decided to go ahead and pull up. I did tell him to say his prayers before he came. Like, you know, say a prayer before you pull up. He must not have said his prayer because instead of him exposing me, I exposed him. Yes, I sure did. I exposed the mess out of him. I exposed him so bad, he's sitting back on his couch right now, literally ready to fall asleep because of what I did to him. His wife can't do nothing for him at all. Hey, what's up, man? How you doing? How does it feel to get exposed? How does it feel to know that your husband just got exposed by me? First of all, how he feels. First of all, nobody got exposed. They didn't. No. But the score don't lie, sir. No. There's no score up there. I beat you. What are you talking about? Oh, you beat me in your mind. There's no score up there, so what scoreboard are you checking? You beat me in your mind, right? Where's the score? Well, I'm going to show you that, but before we do all that, guys, I want to just, you know, like, before I even show the score, man, I want to give a, such a huge congratulations to Miss Bianca, man. Like, I just want to give her a huge congratulations, man, before I show you the score, because this is like a special moment, a very special day, and I've been waiting on this, but I'm going to show you why I'm giving her a huge congratulations. First of all, look at the food that she was eating, guys. Look at this. What the hell is that, man? What is that? I don't know what that is. It's a cookie. So it, it, it was supposed to be a cookie. It is. She couldn't finish it, right? She couldn't finish it. I, anyway, guys, if this wasn't enough of her getting a second scoop of ice cream, did not eat it. She was eating these weird things right here. I don't know what this is, man. Like, it's some type of... Damn, where the hell my hand at? Oh, <laughs> Jesus. Y'all see this right here? She couldn't even eat that. So I just want to say, man, damn. Damn. What <laughs> <The> hell, man? <laughs> I don't know what's yeah, going on. I want to say a huge congratulations to Damien and Bianca. Bianca, anything? What the <laughs> hell is this? Man. You know what, man? I'm just going to say a quick congratulations <laughs> to Damien and Bianca. Stay with the comment sections, because congratulations to Damien and Bianca. For what? I don't know why I'm congratulating them, but I'm starting to see the signs of something. Something weird going on here, man. You got anything that you want to add to this? Like, you got something that you want to tell us? No. Nothing? Nothing? You talking about pregnancy? Oh, pregnancy. I, I, that's the word I was looking for, pregnancy. Huh. How does it feel? That's weird. I should be asking you that. Baby number six? You going Baby from four number, to six? What are you on, seven? Anyway, guys, I'm going to show you guys the score real quick. Oh, Damon Harry up and deleted the score, guys, because he didn't want y'all to see the scoreboard. That's sad, man. He deleted the score. <laughs> That's sad. He deleted the whole score. Y'all wouldn't see it, man. Hey, it's okay. Why you have to delete the scoreboard, man? It wasn't even that serious. It wasn't even that serious for him to even delete the score. You know what, man? I'm going to see you guys in a few minutes, man. I got some business to handle.